Welcome back to Mercedes Lounge. Today we have the all new C-Class. This is the 2023 Mercedes-Benz C300 formatic sedan. We are going for a test drive. I will show you guys the exterior, the interior and sample some of the features of this all new C-Class. Now under the hood is a two liter inline four turbocharged engine that produces 255 horsepower, 295 pound feet of torque and it does it to 60 in six seconds. And that goes through a nine speed automatic transmission as you can see here it's finished in this polar white exterior and has the mg line exterior package which means mercedes star pattern right here on the grille and also the high gloss black elements because this car has the mg night package and also on the side perspective front tires 225 40 r19 these are 19 inch rims and uh, silver brake calipers as well love the high gloss black elements around the windows chrome door handles and uh Wait until we jump inside. This is where the magic happens. Red perspective, LED tail lights, very stylish as well. C300 insignia on the left, formatic on the right hand side, and a very simple red diffuser right here. And uh, finishing high gloss black as well down here. Very nice. And the cargo capacity in the trunk 12.6 cubic feet and uh, electronic tailgate right here closes so fast but it's just a great looking car looks very stylish and uh, the red design rear seats this is the subtle brown with black leather very elegant interior as you can see here it has OLED display touchscreen as well 11.9 inches diagonal and the AMG performance steering wheel with the four spokes touch sensitive buttons let's jump inside and see how this car drives i just love how it looks very elegant high gloss black elements power domes in the hood and also one thing i didn't mention here this car has the digital lights the new digital light from mercedes-benz and has the mercedes-benz insignia digital light right here single eyebrow they do project on the road and uh, they're just so stylish and elegant love the power domes it's a very good looking car and i have the key here with me let's unlock very nice you can see how these leds are very vibrant at night and the mercedes star is illuminated on the ground very good quality and this is the interior Sado brown black leather and it looks so good i'll set the key down here and how about the 64 colors ambient lights in this cabin and uh, it has a metal weave design on the upper dash does look like carbon fiber trim which flows so nicely inside here And the digital light system plays a cool animation at the front let's head on out right off the bat it's a very comfortable ride love the seats love the steering wheel also very soft has leather on the side here with the golf design perforations and also the soft top which is smooth and the engine has a start stop mechanism to conserve fuel uh, the fuel economy in this car is 24 city 36 highway has very good gas mileage because the engine has a 48 volt mild hybrid system which means that it provides additional 20 horsepower with 148 pound feet of torque when you need it for gas free cruising on the freeway and those are my glasses I'm gonna turn off the lights and uh, go for a drive here
right off the bat it's so bright in here I love the 64 colors ambient lights which are voice activated as well hey Mercedes how can I help set the ambient lights to green okay I'm changing the color And as that changes, as we get on the freeway, you see how nice that looks. I will also adjust the dynamic select options. Real quick, I'll show you these options. This car has individual mode, Sport Plus, Sport, Comfort and Eco. I will set the car to the Sport Plus mode. It just takes off. Hey Mercedes. How may I help you? Set ambient light to red. Okay, I'm changing the color. I think this is a much better drive uh, experience with the red colors. Now that's the uh, 64 colors ambient light system. And right here at the center, we have a 11.9 inch touchscreen OLED display which is so cool and uh, the 9 speed automatic transmission does an excellent job of power delivery you might say it's fast I mean it's it has some good punch to the power from this car even though it's a 2 liter inline 4 turbocharged engine, I think it's uh, it's pretty adequate for this car. The weight of this sedan is about 3,800 pounds. Um, so I think it's a um, fairly sufficient engine size for the weight of the car. From the driver's perspective, everything is within reach. I can browse the MBUX infotainment system using the touch pads right here. I can swipe left or right. Another cool feature I love is this info menu. You can see the fuel consumption, vehicle metrics, which means acceleration and braking, as well as engine. Let's see the light show here. See how that cool animation plays here you can see how it's changing and showing the, uh, the the torque the power the boost pressure from the engine just love how it looks here and uh, climate control systems in this car you can access the climate menu right here and you can press each of these two icons so I need some airflow from the turbine inspired air vents here towards my face I think that will be adequate so I'm gonna add some uh... hey Mercedes how can I help I'm hot I'm reducing the temperature to 68 degrees thank you you're welcome so that's a neat system, hands-free driving. Those are the climate control systems. Let's go through the options. We have a navigation menu as well. And the navigation overlays the entire map on the OLED display. Now if you press and hold the home button, you can change the map orientation from a classic layer to a zero layer. And here is the zero layer. Shows you all the icons hidden away at the base in a ribbon fashion. You can see your phone connected. And uh, this car does have Android Auto and Apple CarPlay for the first time wirelessly. So this is the second generation MBUX infotainment system. So this is the Apple CarPlay here. You can 
see all the apps on my smartphone I can make calls I can also use Google Maps here if I don't like the Mercedes Maps system we're gonna exit I'm gonna press and hold the home button and select the zero layer the classic layer rather I'm gonna turn off these lights drive so well right now I'm driving in the spot plus mode which means that uh, there is a sport stiffening on the steering wheel the suspension and uh, the drive dynamics agility in the car is very sporty and this is one of the most comfortable rides I think Mercedes does an excellent job on the seats they just drive so well and you can see how vibrant these lights are the car is also very agile let's turn through here And in addition, other than the navigation system here, which there are a number of shortcuts. You can find previous destinations. You can also find gas stations and parking. Uh, let's look for a gas station here in the vicinity. And say I'm going to choose uh, Philips 66 here. And it pulls the data from Google Maps right here. It also shows a picture of the gas station if you look closely I'm gonna select let's go please follow the road for one mile so as that uh, changes you can also just cancel it because it shows you the time of arrival the distance and the rather the estimated time of arrival overall it's a very elegant system gonna press the home button here through the touch sensitive buttons on the steering wheel right here they're quite sensitive uh, but it's one of the most intuitive systems and also of course part of shifters behind the MG performance steering wheel as you'd expect in this C-Class <coughs> and if I didn't mention the there are some sport pedals down here with the rubber studs so it's very sporty drive experience if I may say um, overall this is one of the I'd say the well balanced and prized um, Mercedes-Benz sedans I think in terms of retail price this C-Class retails at $58,000 now for $58,000 you get a number of uh, different options the Mercedes C-Class has a number of trim packages available. We have a premium trim starts at 46,000, which just includes basic 64 color ambient lights, uh, blind spot assist, pre-safe. And also there is an exclusive trim starts at $49,000, which includes Burmester 3D surround sound system, which this car has online music streaming, wireless charging, surround view cameras and Parktronic. Excellent, and then the highest trim is the Pinnacle trim, starts at $50,000, which includes navigation with augmented video and live traffic map, as well as a head up display system. Obviously, this car doesn't have those options, but this is the exclusive trim, priced at uh, $58,000. And then I can set my phone down here on the charging tray. And overall, it's a very nice and uh, well balanced Mercedes C Class. Uh, that's just a brief look. If you want a more detailed video review, uh, stay tuned. I have another video coming up. I'll leave a link in the description or somewhere along the video here. But uh, until next time, guys, stay positive. Peace.